Hi guys! Welcome to The Last Supper! The show where I cook things out of all the food I have left in my kitchen. So this will be exciting. Let's see what food I have left. Cocoa weeds. Yum! Let's set those there. Um, I have oatmeal in here. Ramen. We could make cocoa ramen wheats. Yum. Lasagna noodles. Um, syrup. Spaghetti noodles. Macaroni and cheese. Progresso light chicken and dumpling soup. Um, Regano. Regano? Regano? Pasta skillet dinner. Stroganoff. Pasta and creamy stroganoff. Naturally flavored sauce mix made with real sour cream. I live with other people, which is why there's so much more food in here. Kirkwood all natural chicken breasts with rib meat. And I have corn and peas. Traditional basil pesto. Chicken broth, fit and active. Tuscan garden, northern Italian with basil and Romano. I have Parmesan cheese and turkey deli meat. This was a bad idea. Why did I think, hey, let's get all the food you have and put it on the counter? Why did I think that would be a good idea? <laughs> Little salad bar, roasted red pepper, topped hummus. These peppers are questionable at best. Ancient harvest, quinoa. Oh, I never noticed this before. They tell you how to pronounce it. Oh, it's not focused. And my camera won't focus. <sighs> well, anyway, right there, it says quinoa. It tells you how to say it. I have garlic cloves. So I actually have a lot, but none of it goes together. So that's fun. Like I have spaghetti noodles and lasagna noodles, but no sauce to go with them. I have this stroganoff meal, but no ground beef to go with it. Okay. So, guys, I don't know what I should make. I think I will make something with my quinoa. Because it's yummy. And I will use chicken broth. And I will add other things. Okay, so we're going to make quinoa with things. And the first step to cooking anything is putting on an apron. You'll put on your apron and then step number two in cooking the food is to get a beverage of your choice. I choose Diet Pepsi. Step three, we need a cutting board. So these are my questionable peppers. I've had them for a while. They might poison me. How do they smell? Like peppers. Well, that's a good sign. <laughs> so I might die, but I do it for you guys. So I'm just gonna attempt not to cut my fingers off. I'm gonna chop these up. Oop, oop. Step four, chop your garlic. Look at that. I don't know if this is how you chop garlic, but this is how I chop garlic. So you guys can deal. Seven, I think. Seven. <laughs> Put your chopped things into a skillet. Then add some oil. Chop it off. 
olive oil. Add just a little splash. Whoop! It's sizzling. It's sizzling. Eight, I think. When your peppers and garlic are sauteed, put them in a little saucepan. Next step, add the quinoa and just pour some in because measuring is not as fun. Um, why not? The whole thing, let's go all the way. Get your chicken broth. And pour some in. That looks appropriate. And then we will bring it to a boil. It's boiling! Look at it! Is this stuff like 10? Let's go with 10. Reduce heat. Reduce the heat. And cover. So stick it on there and let it simmer and stir it occasionally. Okay, you ready guys? Let's see what it looks like. <gasps> Magic! So step 12, I think. Let's give this. A little shake. You don't need to measure. That's very amateurs. Step 13. We'll add in peas and corn. Pour some of that in. Whoa, lots of peas. Stir that in. Let it cook and dump it in. Step 14. We're gonna put some pesto on there. Parmesan cheese, which I'm almost out of. I think I don't have very much left. You know, let's just use the rest of it because it's too much cheese a thing. I don't think it is. We have our quinoa. And so now I'm going to try this. Okay, here we go. It's actually not that bad. Like I would eat this. Like, I'm going to keep eating it, because it really is actually pretty delicious. Yay! I successfully made a meal out of lots of random things that I had. Because quinoa is quinoa awesome. Mm-hmm. So that was the first episode of The Last Supper. Thank you guys for watching. And I kind of decided to start this whole project at an awkward time um, because I'm getting ready to go on Thanksgiving break because I'm in school, college, university, whatever you call it. Um, and so I'm getting ready to go on Thanksgiving break and I'll be at home with my family. And so I always have food there because my mom is awesome. So I'm not going to be able to do any of the last suppers while I'm on Thanksgiving break. Um, and then just a few weeks after I get back from Thanksgiving break, I'm going on Christmas break. And the same thing goes for Christmas break. This goes for Thanksgiving breaks. So I probably won't be filming any um, the last suppers while I'm on Christmas or Thanksgiving break. But I think that what I'm going to do, especially just to like get the hang of this whole vlogging YouTube thing, is I think I'm going to do Vlogmas. So lots of YouTubers do Vlogmas, and in case you don't know, um, I'll be vlogging every day in December, starting December 1st until Christmas. 
Um, and so just like vlogging, what I'm up to, what I'm doing. So if you guys want to keep tubed in, I will be doing Vlogmas starting December 1st. But thank you guys for watching and I will put links down below of like my Twitter and my Tumblr and my Instagram in case you guys want to follow me on there. Um, subscribe and thumbs up the video if you like it. Um, if you have any suggestions of how I should change it or alter it, because obviously this is the first episode, so this is like a new project for me, um, just let me know down below in the comments. Um, and until we dine again, this was the Last Supper, and it was pretty quinoa-some. <laughs>